at the supermoon. Hey guys, it's your Crypt Keeper here with another episode of Paranormal Encounters. Tonight, a case over in Sterling, Connecticut, we did back in the summer 2012. A home that's experiencing some activity. And then from there, we pack it up and shoot over to Norwich, Connecticut. A place right up the street from Norwich State Hospital, where there's a lot of things going on in this tiny little apartment. So, here we go. Check it out. And stuff like that. And he does all the time at night he will just randomly start barking going bananas yeah, and then you let him out time. and yeah. he'll you let him out like and he'll won't go anywhere he'll just yeah. stand there yeah and i don't know because he's defending the house against something he's not sure of it, yeah mm -hmm. and i don't know okay it, could it be a coyote or could it be so i don't know like no, i really don't know bananas. no because it was a coyote she he'd she be, slept here he'd be night. wailing out the house to try and <laughs> oh, that's a good point. Yeah. You know? Yeah. She'd be well out of the house he to chase Yeah, that's the thing. You let him out and it's not like yeah. he's running off. No, you let him out and he no. just stays there. Because like, there are times where he, where he will <laughs> run off. Like if there's another... When yeah. we have yeah. a little yeah. po mama possum that was coming around, he'd be like... Phew, like right over to the woods right where she went. He would follow her scent immediately. Right. But other times he'll... And he'll... I mean, wake me up, bark, 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 and like let him out and he'll just stand there. Okay. And I'm like, really? You're like, you're not even going to pee? <laughs> all that. <laughs> you <feel> awake? <laughs> yeah. Fine. So. All right. So here's the scenario. Okay. This is my professional interpretation of what could possibly be going on. Okay. If this place does have um, people that have passed and decided to stick around, you know, um, it takes a while for spirits to to get used to a family. Mm -hmm. You've said you've been here three and a half years. Three years. Three just, years. just three, three years. years. Three years. I haven't been here that long. And actually, it's, it seems like now more things are happening. Like That's I never what, experienced much of anything. And like I said, right. now it seems like all of a sudden it's like all. What of a happens is, stuff. is spirits will, will be in a house. Mm -hmm. You'll come in. They'll be totally not know who you are, not know anything about mm -hmm. you. They'll go up in the attic or the quietest this basement, mm -hmm. the quietest area. That's where this whole ghost hunting deal goes on, where they have to go find them. We don't go looking for spirits. If they want to come talk to us, right. if they want to tell us who they are, any of that stuff, they'll do it. If they don't want to, there's no way you're going to catch them. You know yeah, what I mean? Course. They, you know they fly sense. at the speed of light. Mm -hmm. But right. Oh, my God. Turn into red. Turn into red. Can I, can I ask you questions? A yes question would be set it off. A no question would be not to set it off. Is there more than five people? <laughs> yes, yes, I can ask you questions that way. Is there more than five of you in this home and on the property? Is there less than five? Let me ask it again. Is there less than five people on this property? Yes. Okay, are, are you a male? Are you a female? Yes, a female. Are you one of the original owners of the home? Did you live on it? In the home when it was first built? Are you from the 1900s? I think that's a yes. Born in the late 1800s or something like that? Yes. Do you know if Bronwyn's dad comes to this property? Is, is he around? Have you met Bronwyn, Bronwyn's dad? Yes. She's saying yes. Now that wasn't your camera, was it? The beep, beep, beep. No, I mean, that set that thing off. No. Okay. Okay, so she's saying your dad is around. Do you want to know his name or no? Huh? Do you want to know his name or it no? Doesn't it doesn't matter. Is he in the, uh, hon, do you know if he's in the home right now? Is he around right now? No. Does he come around just once in a while? Yes. So see, he's all over the place. He's all over the place. He's all over the place. Very interesting. Do you think you might be able to use this device on and tell me your name and it will be very quiet? You did. You try you told me your name. Thank you very much, hon. Um so you're saying it's less than five of you, you're welcome. 
You're saying there's less than five of you on this property. Um, are, are there any children on this property at all? Any children between, say, you know, one or two and uh, 15? Yes, there's some children. Okay. Is there, a, is there any grown males on this property as well? Adult males? Side, aside, obviously, from Bronwyn's um, dad. No. No, no adult males on this property? That's, sorry, you can't answer that question that way. You're saying, let me ask it again, hon, because I, I gave it to you in a, in a pretty weird way that you couldn't answer. Is there any adult males on this property? Yes. Yes, there is. Okay. Thank you. Camera keeps going out of focus. Could, yeah, she's, she's sitting right here. Um, now, I'm wondering your age, and I'm going to go through, I know you probably are over 20. Are you over 20? Are you under 20? Yes. Mm. So are you, are, are you over 18? So we have a, a young lady here. Are you, mm. are you like 16? Set 16. Yeah. She's 16. Wow. Are any of your relatives here with you, hon? No, re no relatives with her? I'll ask it again just to be sure. Are any of your relatives here with you tonight? Or any of your relatives stay here with you? No. Okay. She's so old. <laughs> now I'm just making sure because this girl could be one of those type of people that I was telling you about just floats around. That, that, that just came here because she feels comfortable with your girls. Oh. Let me ask you, I'm, I can't remember if I asked her if she was one of the original people that lived here. Have you? I think you did ask her that. Mm -hmm. I think, I, I don't remember if she responded. Um, all right, let's I'm, see. I just saw the K2 meter actually move. Move physically? Yes. What? It just went up and down. You're kidding me. No. Wait a minute. Okay. Chill. Oh, just just rock. That too. It she's a she's got a she's got a lot of energy. I'm gonna utilize that energy tonight because you, you know, that? if we come back, it probably won't be for a year. Yeah, so I, I want to make sure she she's I, able yeah. to do everything well, she can possibly do. <laughs> it's flat. I'm like, and I saw it. it. You saw it jiggle. You saw it too. Nobody touched it. Let me see. No. See, my arm's moving. Yeah. No. Nothing. Yeah. It's like a She physically moved it. Okay. All right. Um. And you were able to try and tell me your name over that. I'm tr I wanted to know if um, if you were like from. I'm going to give you some dates, and you can respond if the date is the time period when you were alive or when you were around here originally. I mean, I was born in the late fifties. Were you? Were you? Uh, were, I want to know what decade you were born in. I'm guessing probably, I think you said you were born in the 1900s. So I'm going to go backwards. Um, you weren't around in 2000, were you? Were you around in the 1990s? The 1980s? The 1970s? The 1960s, the 1950s, I'm looking for about when you were born. The 1940s, I just heard a bang over there, Was is there somebody there? No, I heard it too. Yeah, mm -hmm. that was a pretty big bang. The 1930s, I think I already said, were you around in the 1920s? 1910? 1900? Were you from the late 1800s? You hear him banging, right? Yeah, but the the neighbors okay. shoot stuff. So She's got a lot of energy. Can't be sure. Were you born in the 1700s? The early 1800s? How about the mid 1800s? Maybe she wore herself out. 
You know what? She might not even be sure when she was born. A lot of times if um, oh. kids were around for a long time, they can't remember. Mm -hmm. Maybe she wore herself out too. She seemed to. She could. She could have worn herself oh, out too. I don't want to wear her out on that. Are you still around, hon? Mm. Did anybody just hear that? I did hear that. <laughs> well, I heard out of my right ear, I just sure heard yeah. Was. I heard a female voice respond to me saying I yeah. Actually, I, I said, are, are you still I around, hon? I swear to God. Did you hear the same thing? I did hear Let it. me repeat it how I heard it and tell me if this is what you heard. I said, are you around, hon? And I heard, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like Almost like Over it was coming there. from right. Mm -hmm. And I got chills all down my right arm. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right, hon. What I'm going to do is try to... Um, could you try to... Um, hopefully you get along with all the other people that... Any of the other people that live here. Um, is there any way you could let them know that we're here and tell them that we want to talk to everybody that's here. The camera's going out of focus for no apparent reason at all. I wow. It's been doing that. Huh? Every time it lights up, my camera goes out of focus. Wow. That was a good start. Yeah. And so both both K2 meters. It just flashed? It just flashed. Okay. Oh, she's saying, yeah, it was a good start. <laughs> Either that or she was saying, yeah, I'll let everybody know that you're here. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to start off in the home we're going to turn off the lights and we're going to turn on this camera right here that takes pictures in total darkness. So if you or anybody else want to show yourselves to us, you'd have that ability. Does that sound good? Just rounding up the troops. <laughs> I'm guessing that yeah. you probably... Just moved again? Mm -hmm. Let's see. She's 16 years old. Probably she might have lived in this house a long time ago. There used to be another house up there. Okay. The original house, like when you walk outside, there's a big patch of tall grass. Okay. And that's where the original house was, right next to the barn. Okay. Is that where you did you live in that house, hon? The house out by the barn? No. You lived in this house, right? She's not answering. Either she's lost her power or now you can also grab energy from us, from the lights, from anything you can find to utilize energy to speak with us. Did you need some kind of help? Are you happy staying here? Because if at any point, we usually will come back to homes once a year. She just clicked it. She just clicked over there. Yeah. Yep. I think she's saying she's happy here. Because mm. <laughs> if at any point... You need help, hon. All you have to do is say, help me over this recorder. And I will help you any way I can, okay? Do you understand that? Yep. Yes, she understands it. Okay. Isn't it interesting that it's just... that are here with us are going to go run and if they see the kids come, they're yeah. used to the kids. They're used to them. Oh no, the kids are home. There's always kids in my house. That's Trigger there. objects. There's just in case. always extra children. Any young kids, they might be interested in doing something. And they might, kids seem to have the most energy. That's why that 16 year old girl has got so much energy because she's young. Young kids have tons of energy. Really? That was a really good orb. Yeah. There it is. Holy crap. Still is. Wow. I'm sorry, did I walk right in front of you? <laughs> yeah. Really? <laughs> 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 wow, look at that orb. <laughs> and you're outnumbered tonight. It's not oh, really. what a lovely person you are. Look. You know what's really funny? I was just... I've got gorgeous hands. I turned my... Listen, <laughs> I, I turned be my like phone off before. Yeah. Yeah. And now I'm... It didn't go off, and now it's jammed. Oh, really? I've never, 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 yeah. ever done that. Like, yeah. they won't do anything. All right, so yeah. I want to, I want all you guys, uh, not weird. not it's these weird. guys, I want uh, the girl and the other people that are here with us to come over here, and I want to show them what I'm, don't stand in front of it, either go in that room or, thank <laughs> you. I want to show you what we got here. This is called an infrared camera, guys. What this can do is if you are, I'm going to turn it on so you can see how we do this. 
goes like that, that, like that, and, oh, sorry guys. You see how you can see over here? I'm going to turn it on so it starts recording. And I'm going to turn a couple lights on so it gets a little brighter. Now, this it's almost completely dark in here, but you can see how this, you can come to this screen and see exactly what this camera's seeing right now. I want any of you at any time tonight, this thing will run for about an hour, so I want you guys to try and do something in front of this camera. If you can try to materialize a little bit so I can see what you look like, either in the shape of a black shadow or something like that, I want you to do that. If you can knock over one of these objects here, this ball, send it knocked over. Or if you go behind this little object here, you see how it has that little uh, white button behind it? You can push that white button and make that thing start blinking. Or you can just knock that thing over if that's what you want to do. I don't care if you break it. But try your hardest. And I'm also going to take one of these K2 meters. Please try not to knock one of these over though, if you can help it. But I'm going to put one of these over here so it might... I know you guys are usually meticulous about how you knock things over. So if you do decide to knock something over, make it the ball or or this light, because when I was at the LNG club last year, I asked you to knock the ball over and you knocked the K2 meter over. But it wasn't you guys. That kind of, I was like yelling, I said, I didn't say the K2. Oh boy, did it get a crowd going. We had a bunch of a big uh, Halloween party at the LNG. Oh, the LNG. Yeah. My yeah. daughter's uh, boyfriend played there quite a few times. Oh yeah? That's cool. Yeah. He's just, he's coming back tonight, he's been on tour. Yeah, there's uh, three spirits in there. Cross country. And I'm going to put the... There's a lot of peeps flying around in here. I'm going to put this... Everybody knows this is the audio recorder. Everybody's got to go up to that and say anything you want. If you want help, say help me. If you want to tell me your name, I'd love that. Anything you guys want to do is going to help Braun and, and everyone here, the kids here, to know a little bit more about you. It's very important. Everyone wants to know about you. I'm guessing your six foot two husband was uh, Irish? Yeah. I'm very sensitive, but my sensitive eyes spotted the pictures on the walls. Oh, the redheads? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the twins are redheads, and the oldest is a redhead. Could somebody answer me over this K2 meter right here? Is everyone that's on this property, like the young lady, are they here right now? Is there anybody that's out toward the barn that doesn't come down this way? Is there anybody else over at the barn that we should meet? It's flat, but I don't know if they're not answering or... Two lights on now and I'll turn the other two on in a minute. Now don't step in front of this camera because this camera probably won't spot you. Make sure you do it in front of that... The camera I told you, the infrared camera right here. At any time tonight that you can get up enough energy to step in front of it, even if we're in another room, please do it, okay? It's very important. It will really help everybody out here to, to know for, for sure you're here. Now the young lady said there was children here as well. Is there any really young children? I'm putting a, uh, a check on this spot right here on the audio recorder. This is going to pick up the whispering over here and that's just the girls talking. If you guys are going to talk, talk sorry. in full voice. Sorry, sorry. Oh, okay. No, that's alright. Well, then you know it's us. Okay. Yeah, that, then I know it's you and then I don't assume it's an EVP and I keep lifting it up and spend an hour on it. Oh, Shh, no. Melissa? No, <laughs> no, I got a watermelon at the grocery store. And it's like, don't! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. Should we sit 
That, yeah. Looks cool on camera, that's for sure. Yeah. Serious moonlight. Sorry. Keep your day, brother. Not bad. Good night, brother. I'm no Bowie. But who the hell is? Bowie from the 80s. See, I'm old too. All you old people. Me and Marissa are the only right. cops in this place. Oh, actually, Ed, I was going to say, I got you all beat, but I don't. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are neck and neck. Yeah. Ed's got two years on me. Really? You got you said you were born in 59? Yeah. yeah I was born I'm, I'm 62 oh, tomorrow. You're 62. <laughs> <laughs> Retirement age. <laughs> Whoa. Dogs are like, yeah. what the hell was that? You can see a lot of stars. There's a bunch of horses. She got a couple horses. I know. You can see a lot of stars. Too. A lot of stars. All the stars are tonight. Dogs are. Stupid moisture in the air. Messing with the camera. Uh, it looks like uh, it's snowing out. Look at all the fireflies. Yeah. Oh, really? I love them. We have a field right near my house where there's like thousands of them. And they just like put on a show. It's freaking amazing. If anyone's out here with us tonight and they want to speak to us, the young lady in the flowery top has got a device with a red light you can speak into. <laughs> Her landlord lives over there. He's probably like, what the heck? He lives in the barn? Over here? No, no, in the house. In that house. Oh. He's probably looking out here like, what the what hell? What the heck is going on? I want to kill my landlord. <laughs> <laughs> so the two horses, are, I would definitely put some light down here because. Yeah, you got to see where you're wait, going. I'll put my flashlight on. Hold on. Well, you know, these bugs can almost. You can almost think they're orbs. Mm. They've got almost that same projectile as an orb. I can barely see their wings. Anybody in the barn that would like to speak to us? Midnight and Curling. Love to say hello. There's two horses. <laughs> There's two horses in here? Yeah. Oh, it's the landlord's horses? No, it's our horses. Oh, wow. You're <laughs> you out in the boondocks. <laughs> we got hay and everything. <laughs> well, no, there's a farmhouse right down the street. Midnight. No, no, they don't poop on this side. They're out in the field. Come here, girl. She's over on the other side. She's, She's like, uh, no. Don't want to come she's in. Like, she's like, do you have food, any, food then? Food, I'll be happy to come in. <laughs> if Otherwise, you screw you. you. <laughs> yeah, so this is the old barn. It has a lot of... Here oh, come. here's midnight. She's like, really? <laughs> come on, girl. Oh, she's not that old, huh? No, no, she's young. This is Curly. He's old. Hi, Curly. Curly. Girl. She's young. Hi, Curly. Curly. Curly's like, oh, I don't know. That's my girl. She's like, like she's looking too. She, here, Curly's a boarder. <laughs> she's fostering. Yeah, hey. she's. <laughs> hey, Curly, how you doing? Foster horse. Yeah, it's our foster horse. Hi, Curly. Come here. Now that you woke them from their slumber. Where are they sleeping? Oh, they were out in the field. Where's midnight? Midnight. Wow, midnight's young. And going pee. Midnight. K2's going, oh, K2's K2's going, going off? Oh my going god. Wow. Oh, shit. Jesus Christ. It was just doing nothing. Is Wow, that when thing's going freaking crazy. When you went to get the grain. Who's here with us? Is that somebody from the house that's with us? It. Yes. Oh, somebody from the house. They came. Well, I invited you guys to come for a walk with us, so I appreciate you coming out. Is that the girl still? Is that somebody else that's setting that off? That was weird. Did Is it the it? young girl that's setting it off? Yeah, there's no... Uh, I didn't even notice it. <laughs> you know, some, well, some spirits can't can't actually manipulate it like that young girl does. They can't do yes and no answers. They can just... Oh, there it goes. It went again. I missed it again. Do you want me to hold it again? Oh, sorry. there it goes again. <laughs> when you went to get the green, yeah, we're walking off. back. Come on, it's home. All right. So, you know, I think there's really no reason to be out here, because I, I... I'm up at the barn. Oh, honey, I'm out in the barn. Mariah's upstairs. Stay up there with her. I'll be back in a few minutes, okay? When I understand, all the, all the spirits are in the house. Yeah, except for Mariah. Yeah, I don't think anything out here. Don't. It, I said, is this somebody that's Here's from what? out here? No, it's... 
Yeah. Somebody from the house, yes. Yes, leave all the stuff. You didn't let Kaiser out, did you? Where is the Kaiser? <laughs> Honey, I'm We're coming back to the house. She's all freaked out now. Well, up at the bottom tree. Stay right there. Is that your younger daughter, the 12 year old? No. 10 year old's yes. freaking out now? Uh, right, she just right. does. Really? No, she's just like, I called your name, Mom. You'll catch that on video. <laughs> <laughs> I called your name, Mommy, and I didn't know where you were. Oh, oh. She yelling for you? Uh. Oh, some serious. There's no mosquitoes, but there's some weird little gnat bugs. Yeah, there always is up here. Really, gnat bugs? Yeah, I can catch shit bugs. Hey, what in the hell is that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> that is paranormal. That's for sure. <laughs> that's a ghost turd. <laughs> oh yeah. It's going. It's going. Good shit right there. It's going crazy. <laughs> Ghost turd. No, this was just going. Oh, that. Oh, then no, that's a skeeter. That's a skeeter. skeeter right in my freaking ear. Than like, mouth. Ee, ee. Oh, Hello. Hello. Wow. That thing's going freaking berserk now. Yeah. Howdy. If that's the young lady or whoever it is, make sure you guys suck up as much energy as you can. Are you guys gonna work on doing something in that camera that's in the house? Trying to. Uh, Stand in front of it or knock something over? Are you going to try? Yes, you're going to try? Oh, cool. Okay. Try your hardest, okay? Wait till we get in there. You I know you there. guys only have so much energy, but if you can knock something over or show yourself on that camera inside, that would be way cool. Maybe you want to wait until we get inside because <laughs> if her just, daughter just sees wait. something getting knocked over and <laughs> and we're yeah. not in the house, she's probably going to be freaking out. You just bleep, like, okay. <laughs> Yeah, you get used to that K2. It's almost like you can figure out exactly what they're saying by the way they're hitting it, you know? <laughs> I'm to the point when people are talking to me on that thing, I'll be like, oh, that was sweet. You know, like I can sense exactly how they're saying things. Oh, I think I just inhaled a gnat. <laughs> well, there's plenty more where that came from. <laughs> And what rhymes with gnat? Cat. Little baby white cat. You guys like the cats? Not so much? It went all the way up a second ago. Like Did it? All the way all right. to the red. Okay, folks, we're coming back in the house, so I want you all... Oh, man. I got serious chills right here. Somebody's hanging out with you? Somebody, like, just, like, stepped right in front of cool, me. but I thought it was the air. That's all right, folks. Don't worry about it. No, it's it is cool, but I can't. See I just got the first. Me, your relatives stay here with you. No. Me, your relatives stay here with you. I just can't. They're different. Because they're seeing it, you know. Yeah. But we're not. But the camera's got more of a spectrum of light than than we do. This audio recorder picks up things that is not in our hearing range, you know? Right. There's um, frequencies that you can feel vibrations of, but you can't hear with your ears. Mm -hmm. You know, that's where, where like ultrasonic low bass comes in. You know, you can't hear ultrasonic bass. You can just, she knows from being a corn fan, you just can just hear the <laughs> thwack of it. The boom, boom. <laughs> like when cars drive yeah. by playing rap. Yeah. Boom, yeah. Boom, yeah. Boom. yeah. You know, that's, you're not hearing the bass, you're hearing the the, the thud of it hitting the car and making the car vibrate. That's something our ears can't hear. Ultra high frequencies animals can hear, but we can't. Mm -hmm. That's just, you know, we're limited creatures, you know? And, and when you pass on to this, you know, um, this next uh, step, you know, you're, you have a lot more abilities, you know? Right. I mean, spirits, in, in my opinion, I don't know this for a fact, but I've asked the question and I've got a yes reply and see 360 degrees, <coughs> degrees around them. Wow. They don't have a head to obstruct their view. You know? Right, they're just energy. So they can be sitting there looking at Braun and looking at me at the same time, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, cool. Yeah, I, I, you know, it's 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 hard to even fathom, mm -hmm. you know? Huh? They went off. K2 meter went off? No, no. Yeah, they were. Camera. Camera. 
Okay. Oh, the camera went off? Yeah, it's uh, probably starting to get low. Oh, uh, they didn't knock that wall open. I got a, uh, I like the cord part, but I didn't think to bring it with me. I usually run it for an hour because mm -hmm. if they haven't done anything in that they're first hour, they're probably not going to do it. That's just the way it is, you know. Maybe they were excited at first that somebody actually... I know. They're I still excited. They they excited. They there. You, you know, know what I mean? that's what I'm saying. On a virgin investigation, yeah. I mean, they're thrilled, you know? Yeah. It's like there's kids walking around, like walking right by them, and, you know, you're walking right by them, and yeah, nobody's acknowledging them. And then all of a sudden you get this... Um, you know, you get somebody that comes in and goes, hi, I want to talk to you. And they're like, who, me? <laughs> yeah, you. It'll, it'll probably only go for a couple more minutes. Guys, you might have a couple more minutes on this camera. So if you can go by this way again, that would be really cool. I'll be able to tell if it was a bug. As I was saying about a bug, mm -hmm. a bug has an elongation to it. It has like a, it's like a jagged look. <coughs> shoots by because yeah. the camera's picking up its fluttering. And it might, there's that one bug that's flying around, so who knows what <clears> I'm Yeah, doing. there's a couple bugs that are flying around. It's just really weird the way you said, it's right over here. Once you see it on a screen, it's like there's no there's no uh, disputing an orb from a bug. But Melissa you know? said you t you got some pictures of orbs in the living room? No, yeah, yeah. yeah. Outside. We got pictures well, see, of orbs. See, now it says outside. low battery, which it didn't do yeah. before. Yeah, it's, it's, that's it's, weird. It's, well, no. I mean, I mean, it doesn't tell you. It'll just go out and then sometimes it'll yeah, just go. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's that one yeah, it's it's going to be a trail of the orbs. Right. Um, now, we got pictures from Seaside of, of of us walking around, and you can see like 30 orbs like swirling around us, right. like just following us. All the energy. And I had a guy on the page that said, how do you know those aren't bugs? They said, do you ever see bugs going in and out of concrete? No. <laughs> They'll go right into the concrete yeah. and then come flying like right out. Like it goes like boom, right into the right. wall. And he looked at it again and he got back to me and goes, to tell you the truth, no, I never did see bugs. <laughs> <laughs> okay then. That pretty much uh, squashes that Check. thing, right? <laughs> Checkmate. Yeah. Wow, that's interesting. Yeah, it's like they just disappear into yeah. the walls. I mean, we're really cautious as a team about, you know, putting out things we're not sure of. Oh, sure, yeah. yeah. And, you know, it's, it's, it's such a, such a, you know, Newly discovered, well, it's not newly discovered. I mean, people know about spirits throughout history, but. Oh, well, this new equipment, though. One little response. You what? said newly discovered. But, you know, people have just started interacting with them in this way, you know? I just turned it on for a second to see if I'm going to call it. All right, calm down, kids. <sighs> so we're doing Kenny Walcombe's place Wednesday. Oh, you did that before, it's right? so funny because oh God, yeah. I Every... just told Anita that you guys were coming here. <laughs> Tonight. Yeah. She's like, really? I said, yeah. Is Kenny's house to see if activity in his house? Oh my yeah. God. Oh, yeah. No, not his house, the, the neighborhood. The one next door? Is yeah. Next door? We've got some amazing stuff from his house. Yeah. Oh my God. Um, okay. oh, sh That's all right. It's not That's not okay. paranormal, guys. <laughs> <laughs> that is just a... What you call a magnet. <laughs> birthday party invitation. It's all wrong. <laughs> all right. Oh, yeah, it's a little thick in here. Every place you go, though, has different feelings. Some place you get the chills. Mm -hmm. Some place, you know, you get loopy. I mean, it just depends on where you are, what place it is. Brooklyn, you just get the absolute creepiest oh, feeling in the world. And that's a really old town, too. It's a really old No, but that building where, where Michael Ross dumped those bodies. I know, huh? I mean, Marissa had, you know, three or four days of oh. of being followed around after yeah. she left there. We were all messed up yeah. after that. Yeah. yeah. She wasn't sleeping? Yeah. I no. Didn't sleep. I didn't sleep for, I think, like, three oh, or wow. four nights. And that's... Every time I would go to sleep, like I'd wake up. And All right, I'm gonna tag that that noise. That oh, wow. Oh yeah. That's a breathy. Somebody did a breathy wow. Yeah. Mm. No, I just ta I don't do that to insult you guys. I do it so I know when I'm mixing. Yeah. Oh, those are nice pewter uh, candle holders. <laughs> brass. Is that brass? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that's even I got nicer. A wedding present. Um, that's cool. Twenty <laughs> many some odd years ago. ago. Wow. What are a few things I get? When she was 14. Yeah, yeah, that's right. 
Yeah. 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 Twenty three. Twenty three when I got married. So it was twenty two years ago. Something like twenty three years ago. Twenty three years ago. It's alright. You don't have to give us an egg. You don't have to give our fans an exact date. <laughs> yeah. Let them let them guess. <laughs> and it's funny because they they were a wedding gift and they were um you the woman that bought them for me um got them in an antique shop and missed it. Wow. Have chance. you ever done uh, the Ledge Lighthouse? No, nah, there's only one spirit there. Bernie. Bernie. <laughs> That's not fun. <laughs> not oh fun my god, what are you <laughs> doing? <laughs> Keeping you awake. Who's driving home? I am. <laughs> <laughs> this one. Uh, the old she man. hates driving as it is. Yeah, me too. Did you come down 14? Is that where you saw that house? Yeah. Who the hell knows? <laughs> Came down you someplace. Did you get on I just know TV? Marissa's yeah. gonna be half asleep in the car, smoking a freaking right. non-filter freaking cigarette out the, showing <laughs> <laughs> right. on some freaking scold and <laughs> spit. <Ew>. Scold. <laughs> <laughs> Here, pull over so I can spit. <laughs> <laughs> That's sexy. As long as oh, it is. It's hot. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing like French kissing a woman after scold. Oh, yeah. <laughs> scold. <laughs> Especially the minty one. Are you being naughty? <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez, you can't leave them alone in a room too long. Bunk beds? Aren't they a little old for bunk beds? Like breaking out? No, they're ten. They're only ten. <laughs> yeah, I know, but I thought bunk beds were little kids. Nah. Well, little kids fall off the top of oh, yeah. Wow. You're actually supposed to do it when they're a little bit older. <laughs> What's with that picture of the guy with the uh, trooper the hat on or whatever? Oh, I want to oh. see the dog. Brown one, I'll tell you. Will he bite me? No, but he'll jump Girl. on you. Oh, oh he's cute. I'm going to let him out of the No, no. I want to say hi. 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 Oh, he's scared. Oh. Say hi. Oh, he just wants to jump scared. on you. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Yeah. Whoa. He doesn't like men. I'm sorry. Oh, he doesn't like oh, men? No. He doesn't. That's a big dog. That's yeah, weird. he does. He only yeah. likes Jeff. Why doesn't he like men? He likes Brown One's boyfriend. Why does he like Because like men drool. Because I think it's stupid. Because they're gross. <laughs> <laughs> he's very good his mom. Um, <laughs> so therefore, he doesn't like men. That's only my Jeff. personal opinion. Only Jeff. He just likes Jeff, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I don't really know why. He has homosexual tendencies towards Jeff. Ew. Yeah. He gets very Not that there's anything wrong with that. Seinfeld. <laughs> 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 Anybody want to play ball with me? I'm playing with this ball. <laughs> that does have sexual innuendos. Yeah. Yes, it does. <laughs> Most things I say do. Leave it to my kids. Most things she says, yes. It has some sort of connotation. <laughs> I don't know where you got that from. And, uh, I can't imagine. <laughs> well, I'm going to be here for a short while more, folks. I'm going to turn down this camera as low as I can. And could you try to step in front of it? You can see where I have it pointed. I'm just looking to try and see a shadow. If anybody can form one in front of this camera. Is that possible? You could walk from left to right. Yeah, I'm just feeling kind of creepy in this room. You know? Oh, comfortable couch. Yeah. We're not going to be here much longer, guys. We know we really pooped out your energy awful quick, so... 
We just want to make sure you go in the other room and everyone tell us everything you need to tell us so we can uh, relay that message to Braun and to the girls, okay? Very important. If there's any problems you need to uh, address, you can do that over that white recorder. Do you understand? I just heard another voice. When I said, do you understand, I heard, yeah. I probably got it over this camera. It was very clear. And I really don't think it was them in the other room. Although there's been a couple of... There's somebody sitting right next to me. Take a shot. Could you guys try to get in front of Marissa's camera right now? I'm going to count back from 10. Step in front of her camera. She's going to try to take your picture, okay? Whoa. Was that a bug or was that an orb? I'm not even sure. I'll find that out tonight. That was kind of odd. Bronwyn's still here in a year and she wants to come back in we'll come back and visit you if that's alright do you mind if we come and visit you again next year we find that like every eight to seven or eight months you guys have got your energy back up and you're able to really say and do a lot of stuff so what's important right now is you say as much stuff over that audio recorder as you possibly can, okay? The one sitting in there with the girls. Alright, something is crawling. Nope. There's nothing on my hand right now. I don't know what... Alright, there's somebody sitting right to the right of me now. Could you say, tell me over the recorder who it is that's sitting right next to me? That's you guys, right? Yes. Yeah. I just like to tag everything so there's no misinterpretation. We got to have our cred. Yeah, there's, I am getting like total. Could the person that's sitting to the right of me, is this, is it, does the, the dog sleep right here on this white thing? Yeah. Okay. I'm just wondering, is it possible? And I don't mean to insult you, Braun. Is it possible there's fleas on this? No, I just, no, I just washed everything today. No. No, that's not a flea. I would see the flea. Because the fleas jump. Right. This is something like touching my hand right now. Well, I told you that's what the girl said. And there's, and there's nothing there. In the bathroom, remember? Yeah, there's, there's something touching my hand in the most unusual way. It's actually making... Holy crap. It's actually making the veins on my hand stick out. It's almost like they're underneath the skin. That is weird. I'm documenting all this because my veins don't usually stick out like that. <laughs> that is the creepiest thing. Oh, wow. Can you see that? No, I just got something else really weird. Right, taking a picture near my hand? Yeah, you want to see? Yeah. Yeah, because something's right here on to the right of me. Oh, yeah. Is that near my hand? Where is that? Yeah. Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, see, it's right near my recorder. Yep. Wow. Look at that. Oh, my God. That's freaking insane. Yeah, something's right here by the right of me, touching my hand, letting me know that they're they, they're, they're around. And, and my right side is, is getting all tingly. Don't move. I want you to stay there. I just, um... That's what's touching my hand right now. See, now I'm going to show you guys that whatever was right on top of my hand is gone right now. Cause
Awesome. Got somebody hanging out with you. <laughs> yeah, it got really thick over there. Now what it was was um, spirits will like come up to you and like get close to you and sometimes when they actually will sit on your skin or enter your body accidentally mm -hmm. it'll actually affect your body mm -hmm. and in the veins right up here in my arm I, my veins don't usually show that much they started like popping right out yeah. and then I just showed it after it went away you know it was like I felt like something was crawling on my skin and I keep documenting that nothing was there mm -hmm. and um and then when it went away, the feeling went away that my veins went back to normal again. Well, that's interesting because that's where she said all the orbs were. Yeah. yeah. Of, which is, that's the uh, part of the original part of the house. Is, is yeah. This, these two rooms right here. Yeah. Yeah, there's, there's somebody that's like totally on top of me right now. Somebody feels real comfortable with me. You get... You get like feelings. That's the dog. That's my dog. That's your dog? I'm going He wants to come in the house. I'm going to let him. Sound like it was over there. I'm going to let him. It was him back there? Okay. Yeah. You can see him through the glass. Yeah, no, I see him. I just. <laughs> it, sounded, it sounded to me like it was. Did the person that's sitting next to me able to go to the recorder and tell me who they are? Grimm's Fairy Tales. Spooky. Now that was a bug right there. I want to document that because I want to compare that to the orbs I saw on film to make sure there's a difference. That I saw with my own eyes. You just walked right where I just captured him. Really? Yeah, somebody's right on top of me. What the hell was that? Was that in the other room? Yes. What? What chair. was it? Chair. Yeah, but what did it sound like? Did it sound? Did it sound like kind of like? No. Now see, but it's funny you say that because before, when she showed me that picture, I heard that. What you just said? It sounded like somebody calling my name, and I'm I can't. I'll, I'll know by the camera. When well, when you go back and look at it. Holy crap! I told you there was somebody on top of me. Show those guys that. This awesome. Yeah, there's something just called my name right in my right ear. Wow. <laughs> it's so defined. Yeah. I like, yeah. I told you there's somebody like hanging out with me. I don't know. Somebody. I can, uh, can't, can't really do much of it. Like wow, that's amazing. But when she showed me that other one. Yeah. I, th I didn't say anything, but I thought I heard somebody nice. say something. No, this said Ed, I'm pretty sure, but in a breathy way. Yeah, yeah. That's what I thought I heard. So it sounded like a male voice to me. It didn't sound female. No, it sounded like a voice, like a man. A, a man or a, yeah. But it sounded like, I couldn't really, but I didn't, I just. Yeah. You're just tripping out, it was all thing. But just, well, you'll hear it. And then he had just walked into it. He's tall. Wow. Wow. Yeah, I know. Yeah, Remember, folks, you said you were going to attempt to walk in front of that, so, or do something over here, so try to stick to that. Ooh, I just, just saw, like, something fly by. Then over here, so, try to stick, then over here, so, try to stick, then over here, so, try to stick. Was that you? What was that? That wasn't you? No. What, 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 what the, not the clink. Yeah. Oh, that was my camera. Oh. That little clink. Right. I don't know. I'm, that's going to bug me now. Because I, I mean, I didn't move anything here. <laughs> there it is. It's underneath here. I don't know how the hell it got underneath there. But. Right, I just wanted to turn this off so the cat doesn't set it off. Because <laughs> that would, that poor cat would jump sky high. I would laugh so hard. I know. Just because he's such a butthead. I know. Alright. Now. 
I'm not going to stay much longer, guys, so this is your opportunity to really let me know who you are. I respect the fact that you weren't that insulting to me. A couple of you were testing me, but you weren't too bad. I appreciate that. There's definitely a hornet's nest of you guys in this home, that's a for sure. I feel like somebody's sitting on my chest. Yeah, it's, it's just the thickness in here. It's uncanny, you know? Yeah. It's unbelievable. But you know what's weird? A lot of times they won't set off. I think different spirits have different... Um, Abilities? Yeah, and, and some I, of them... I have some, like Seaside, they set that... K2 meter off constantly. It's like the thing's going the whole time we're around. But then again, they move objects a lot too. So. Well, mine do too. <laughs> yeah. Mine throws though. I think it depends on the spirit. I think certain spirits have certain talents, some don't. So how far from here are you moving? I'm sorry, I was drinking. Oh no, that's okay. Um, cotton. Oh, that's cool. Use my energy if you need to. They're trying. They're trying. Yeah, they are. Because I'm getting busy. My arm cold. Oh, really? Got my arm right here. Oh, oh okay. Is that? Oh, that was that. I thought something actually grabbed my leg. I was like, oh, that would have been cool. What's that? Sound like I said, I thought something grabbed my leg and I thought I heard grab it. Who's touching my arm? I know being sick doesn't cost me a lot of energy, but you can use it. I will recover. Oh, hi, honey. I feel my arm right, just right here. It's right there? Right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, you see Cole. Hey, baby. She's, he's touching my arm. It's the little boy. Is it this is the one that's really sweet, right? Is this a bo Hi! This one's sweet. Yeah. Is this a girl or a boy? Boy. Yeah. He's mentally retarded. He is? What do you mean? He's mentally retarded. How's a cat mentally retarded? Fifth generation inbred. Really? So how, how, what makes, leads you to believe it's retarded? Ah! Aside from the fact what? that he What's barked? wrong? Why are you barking for no apparent reason? Because I'm petting the cats or because the no. spirits are bothering you? Too much energy? Too much energy for you to handle, hon? It's okay. No, yes, it's okay. How many now, hon? How many spirits here now? Six? Yeah, I lost a lot of them. Ten of them got bored with me. Where do they go? They go through all these other apartments too? Or did they go back to the hospital? Oh. Are you guys up in the attic? This is kind of an old building too with some net walls. Mm -hmm. That's kind of odd. Ah! What's wrong? There's something up there. And he sees this yeah. too. That's where the one that attacks me all the time is at. Oh, Always really? sits right there on that corner of the bed. And that's usually where I get attacked. Mm -hmm. It's alright, baby. Oh, that's here. What? Um, This is the reason that 
I have what I need on the table. The ones that are attacking me. Look at that one and tell me what doesn't match. Or what shouldn't be there. Oh yeah, that's... That odd shadow in the background? Uh-uh. Something behind her? Her shoulder. The... The little thing behind her shoulder? No, the hand on her shoulder. Oh, you mean on the left side? Yep. Yeah, I, was, I saw that at first and I wasn't sure what the hell that was. That's it. Yeah, I, it, I took that it's out. It's kind of transparent. I took that out from her because she was being tortured by this thing. Wow. Mm -hmm. I still don't understand and that's why. the other one. Why is your brother considered retarded? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> See, because he's dumb as a box of logs. Is he dumb as a box of logs? Who's here? Anybody else want to pipe in before I leave? See, I told you I wasn't going to... Who? I know you've all expended a lot of energy already. Yeah. You can use me again. We're definitely running now. What do you say? Tell me. That, that's the top of the dial. That might be that one station that's kicking in. There's one station right at 1,000 that kicks in. What? Hi. What's your name, bud? Can you tell me your name, bud? It's all right. Matt or Matthew? Did you say Matt? That's where that's my brother's name. Oh, really? That sounds like, uh huh. Is your brother still alive? Uh -huh. yeah. No. No? What do you mean you don't know if he's still alive? I haven't heard from him since. March? That was weird. Why did you say no? Her brother's not living. Do you know her brother? Yeah? Is her brother around? With you guys? I think you're just guessing the brother's not around, aren't you? You know that for a fact? Hey. Stop. It's okay. He's getting freaked out. Do you know for a fact that the brothers passed over? Mom, I need you now. Hi, Mama. I need you. She said I need you. Mom, is Matt dead? Mom, come on, you can do it. I would think if Matt was passed over that he would pipe through on this thing. He wouldn't come to me. Oh, no. Me. Is there anybody that confirmed that Matt has passed over? No. That was the reason for so, so that guy was just speculating, or he wanted to mess with uh, Cece, right?
So they're just playing with her. It's what? not funny if it's not true. That's not cool. Why would you guys do that? Because you're bored? Is that why you do it? Is that why you mess with her? Just to get a kick out of it? You get a kick out of upsetting her? What do you mean not yet? Do you mean you don't want me to leave yet? Yes, no. Uh-uh. Tell me why. Is that just a mole he's got there, or is that a tick? It's a mole. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, what? Oh, no. You guys are winding down. And so am I. I gotta go to work in a few hours, so... I said I gotta go to work in a couple hours. I work overnight. I work the graveyard shift. Yeah, I do. I don't. I didn't. Don't mean I work in a graveyard. I mean, I work the night shift. They call. Oh. They call that the graveyard shift. <laughs> I don't mean I work in a graveyard. Not that I'd have any problems with that. I mean, I wouldn't have any problems hanging out with you guys. That's for sure. Is there any spirits in that Jewish cemetery? You think so? Boy. That guy's cool. He seems like a nice guy. Do you come from Norwood State, buddy? No. But you do hang out with some of those guys from season, from uh, Norwich State? They're a lively bunch, huh? Good night, Irene.